Great, Liverpool have scored in every game they've played in every competition going back to April. How does it feel to be the man to stop them? Yeah, so good because we are, like I said, we are Manchester United. We are one of the biggest club in the world, and every, against every opponent we play, we want to win. Today we got one point. We we fight together. We show a lot of character, a lot of personality, but it's not enough. No, that's another game where we play. We have to try to win. Again, unfortunately, we didn't, we didn't win today. We have to, um, we have to put the standard higher. That's another game we, where we play. We have to go to win. Despite the team not getting the three points, can you take pride in your performance? You made eight saves. You made 15 uh, long passes that you completed. You, pretty much a perfect performance from a goalkeeper. No, I would say not. Because the most important thing is for is the three points. You know, when you come in Anfield, it would be great going back at home with the, with the three points. But like I said, if you have a clinch, it is good. But the most important thing is to win the game. And we came here. It was a tough game, of course, but being um, part of this big club, you, you must um, win. And we had some, not too much chances, but we could, uh, we could score. So now head up, getting ready for the, for the coming games. And uh, we have to look forward because um, it's, not, it's not enough. We have to go. We have to do much more. You mentioned Anfield, that this is your first taste of it. It sort of has a myth about the atmosphere here. And at points, it was all directed at you when you were taking goal kicks. Did you notice it? Nothing. Manchester United will be part of them. I want to be ready for everything. I'm used to play high games, big games, with high intensity. So that's why they brought me here. Like I said today, it was a nice game for us to play. We, we, we face a very good opponent, but we show so we are good players. We are big club. That's why we, we are going back with that point. But like I said, being Manchester United, you, you must try to win, you must win every game. Finally, there was a moment in the second half where you played a long ball to Anthony and almost created a goal for us. How important is it for you that you're not just preventing goals, but you're also having a hand in creating them? For me, it's quite easy to do that. But uh, what I would love to say is the move from Anthony, because those players are making things very easy for me. When he make that, that run, he's giving me the space to play. So for me, when I saw Anthony running there, I was like, well, thank you, God. What a great move from, from me. So I think... Uh, we have to congratulate Anthony to make that run because um, for me put, put the ball over there is quite easy. Is your is your mindset always like this? Because I said like your goalkeeping performance today was excellent. I, the pass to Anthony was superb, and you you focus so much on the team rather than yourself. Yes, yes, because we're a big club, you know, and this club deserves uh, much more than what we are facing too. So we have to be humble, and we have to be um, we have to take responsibility because we. Of course, no one is happy with the situation we are facing. We have to stay positive because it will change. And uh, like I said, everything in life is temporary. Uh, we are facing a difficult period. Better days will come, I'm very sure. And when I see how you work, how you train, I'm convinced it will change. So maybe I have the right to take responsibility when things are going wrong. But they have also to congratulate my teammates when they are doing very good. So, like you said about the move of Anthony, so uh, we are here to help each other. And like I always say, when things are going good.